Welcome back to my channel. Sorry I'm looking a little crazy. I just came back from home time. As promised, I'm gonna do give you the guys the truck tour. Um, mind you, I just got in here, so I didn't get a chance to tidy up or anything. Um, so here we go, let's start in a minute. Okay, this is the front of my truck, which I believe I already showed you guys. That's my trash, I just came from the market. Um, Peterbilt, this is my little seat that I sit on sometimes, but this one doesn't really, uh, it's not really that comfortable. That's my Qualcomm. This is like a little table that you can sit and work on. This is the glove department. Uh, little storage space, not much. I keep my bags, like my, um, you know, my shopping bags. When you go shopping, you have, uh, you know, the bags that you empty out. I put my bags in there. It has a little hook thingy that you can hang up your coats or whatever. Um, a little cubby up there. I forgot what I put up there. Let me see if I could show you. Oh, um... Yeah, a little Tupperware. Something to cook inside. This is my um, Garmin. I have this one. I got it out of the Prime store. Um, I don't know what that other box is, but you get the drift. This is cabinet with my personal clothes in here. I'm not going to open that, but... I am gonna show you my fridge and what's in it. Okay, here's my fridge. I just finished going shopping. I got salmon, already seasoned chicken, which is curry, shish kebabs, bacon, sausage, uh, that apple juice I had already. I got butter. That's some broccoli and some rice. I don't know if you guys like this, but I got this ginger paste. It works real good when you uh, season and meat. And then down here, which I overstuffed. Oh crap, yeah, I overstuffed it. I'll uh, come back when I can uh, show you guys uh, properly. This refrigerator I got from the Prime Store, it was $700. And that's the only fridge that'll fit on this uh, truck. Um, this is my sleeping area. Mind you, I just got on the truck, so it's not really that tidy. I use an iPad. I don't have a TV yet. Um, this is my bed. This bed is not really comfortable. So um, if you get a Peterbilt, you should get the Peterbilt mattress because it's comfortable. And I told you guys, I lost my husband, so I keep some of his stuff on my bed. This was um, a shirt that he wore on my truck. I usually just take it and I sniff it every now and then. Call me whatever, I don't care, but I do. This is my little cooking area. Sorry, it's not really that tidy. Um, and it's not really that messy either. But um, this is just utensils. I'm gonna put that away. The next time you guys uh, see a video from me, I'm gonna have everything uh, in order. I just wanted to get this video out. Um, this is a microwave that I got from the uh, Prime. Um, that's another cooking uh, thing. I don't like it, I might take it back. I didn't open it or anything. I wanna get something that you can actually plug in. Uh, this, it's actually strapped in so it won't move when you um, are driving this is my uh, top bunk which I don't really use but I do have a luggage up there um, this top bunk is really cool I know you saw other Peterbilt videos you pull this be careful when you pull when you pull this down it actually falls down so you got to be careful 
and this is pretty cool because once you if you want to go up there you have like company or whatever the ladder let me show you again it's like a little piece right here that you pull on and the ladder comes down really cool and then to put it back up you just go like that yeah it's just my luggage nothing else is up there um to put it back all you have to do is plop it back up and it's in there all of my win windows have the covers on them this is the tv mount thing that i'll be using when i get my tv um my uh seat belt thingy for the bed i pushed it down there because it was getting on my nerves um this little thing here you can actually sit on it which i think is pretty cool i use this uh for cooking um as i told you i have another one but i don't like it i'm gonna get something from walmart this is a little compartment right here um that you can put your little spices seasonings your cups your utensils whatever and yeah um since i drive a truck that um my trailer is reefer i got me a little broom i also have like a little vacuum for inside here which i have to um actually get to since i just got in here um right here i have a little cabinet which is not messy at all i have my sneakers there i don't know why my stuff is not in order because this is just like my fourth week uh here that's my uh little vacuum here it is i got some stuff in there i've been vacuuming it comes with two different uh pieces this is one of them don't buy my nails so i'm gonna take them off and cut them off i mean um that's an atlas i was thinking about taking that back because uh i don't use it and i'll be back in a second to show you something else okay uh it's not open perfectly but it's open i got some uh pancake mix rice um cup of noodles more rice more ramen you know just a little basic so i can eat while i'm out here i don't know where they're sending me i'm waiting for a load right now um if anybody knows how to fix this i don't know how it fell down but it did my curtain thing this is the other part i don't know how to put this back i tried but nothing was working so i'm gonna have to go to the terminal to get them to fix that because i don't know how to do it by myself for now when i want to uh go to sleep i'm gonna have to just use these curtains here so anyway i have a uh, my little headset i barely use it because when you're on the truck by yourself just hook your uh, phone to your bluetooth uh here is my uh garmin um i use this along with my uh garmin uh my quailcom too uh this is a magnetic uh phone uh holder which I usually use uh, often when I'm driving so I don't have to pick up my phone and touch it because cops will get you for uh, not doing uh, hands-free. So uh, this is actually the area, well, not the area, well, the little area that I come to when I go shopping, when I'm at home. They have a Dollar Tree a gym, a dentist, a Sally's, GNC, uh, if you play lottery, it's a lottery place right there. Chinese restaurant, they have the best chicken and broccoli. Um, and this place, this is where you can get your Wi-Fi for your uh, truck if you need. Um, I have a Wi-Fi router for my truck and I use T-Mobile. Uh, they got a place to file your taxes. For people that drink, there's a liquor store. I'm not promoting that though. Uh, they have a rent center, a laundromat, 
uh, they got a D2 there and a Western beef, which I just came out of. So um, I'll see you in the next clip. All right, over here, I have toilet tissue. I don't know why, because I don't have a toilet on here. I have paper towel, you know, to do a little cleaning here and there. Uh, this is my Wi-Fi router. Um, T-Mobile. It works really good. You can connect uh, many devices on it, meaning your TV, your iPad, uh, your phones, whatever you have. There's nothing else uh, back here uh, to show you. But um, if you give me a minute, I'll show you outside. And that will be the end of the video. I love you guys. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And share with a friend. Oh, and I will be leaving my um, referral code on the screen if you guys uh, ever want to come to Prime. All right, I love you guys. See you in a minute. All right, you guys, so I'm outside. This is the back of my truck. I have load bars. That's my um, APU over there. Let me go and show you. So I'm basically doing a pre-trip now too at the same time. It's my APU. I have to uh, get more low bars, but so far, so far I haven't used any. This is my truck on this side. This is a door you need a key to uh, open. It don't just plop open. Uh, the front of my truck. show you something really cool but you probably already seen already but this is a little door you go shopping you get lazy you don't feel like climbing all up in the truck with all of your groceries you could just throw them up there I wouldn't because my bed is there um, this is how I wash my dishes I have done I have this I saw another youtuber do this so um i decided to do it too he didn't have this but you know you just pull it out like this have your dishes you wash them see i already been washing something and it falls on the floor uh get, you get it all clean that's what i use my paper towel for too then i usually just push this back in that's the apu um I don't know what a lot of this stuff is, but you get all of this stuff from the terminals. Not tidy, but you know, when you're driving, you're moving all this, the truck is jiggling everything around and stuff comes out of order. I have windshield wipers. This is my uh, triangles. Some of this stuff was already in my truck. Um, this is a 2024 um, Peterbilt. 579 so this is pretty cool I love this door the Freightliner that I had with Western Express didn't have that um, let me show you the front of the truck dear guard I never had one this is the front of my truck I have to get it washed it's dirty so yeah I need to get it washed but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my Pete. It rides smooth. It rides uh, way better than the Fright. No shaking, no jiggling, none of that. So, oh, I didn't even notice this. They got a little mirror. Look at that. Got a little mirror on the side. But uh, yeah, this is where I put my def. Diesel. Yeah, I need to get it washed. It's dirty coupling wasn't in properly but it is now okay so uh yeah that's about it that's the whole truck i love you guys remember to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in my next video love you